Casper Jackson is faster than you. We need you to let it pass. Do you copy, Casper? Let Jackson pass, please. I don't understand. You can have the place back if you can't pull away. Is he landing quicker? Yeah, he's behind you, Casper. Confirm you'll let it pass, please. Look, he's not close enough. Come on, Casper. Casper, don't do this. He's not faster. This is a team order. Do you copy, Casper? He's not faster. We've only got two laps of fuel left. Pick up rubber and bring it home. You've got to ask yourself just what's going on behind the scenes at Haas. This rivalry between the two drivers, it's not going away. You wonder how many more points they're going to squander. I think Haas have got a real problem here that they need to deal with. I don't know how, but they've got to address it. You think of what happened in Mexico last season. The two drivers took each other out of the race completely. How long before we see a repeat of that? As you so rightly say, Ant, something's clearly not right over there. Mercedes are on top form once again after an excellent race weekend. It's great to see them up on that podium once again. respect you give respect that's how it works how about you give me a little respect how about you earn it first how am i supposed to do that i'm all ears you give me space out there what's your problem i'm trying to win oh and that makes you special you're a nightmare casper well you won't have to put up with me for much longer What's that supposed to mean? 
I am sick and tired of all this. I'm done. You what? I'm retiring. Wait. What? Casper! Casper! Tire temperature, Casper? Is, is the safety car for Aiden? Aiden's had to come in. Now's a good time to catch up with the field. Yeah, I'm trying. Work, Casper. Push for 10. See if you can salvage some points. Yeah. Green flag. Green flag? We're racing again.
return the position. Top 10 now, keep it up. That's the end of the race, we'll see you in Park Ferme. Ackerman's done well to finish in the points there, in stark contrast to his ass teammate Aidan Jackson, who Ant didn't even finish. Yeah, Jackson's looked off the pace all weekend. His performance just isn't where it should be. You can see the odd error creeping in on track too. Well, if you believe the rumours, the Haas camp is not the happiest of places right now. Yeah, and that can affect even the most experienced of drivers. I just hope Jackson gets his act together. He's a promising talent and he's much better than this. Red Bull are our winners today after showcasing some incredible driving. There's been a huge push from them lately to stay competitive with the other teams. And they're certainly proving themselves. Great work out there today. Let's have your thoughts. Today's race certainly had its ups and downs for you, Casper. Are you pleased with that performance? Yeah, it wasn't easy today. I somehow kept finding myself in the wrong place at the wrong time, so really happy to salvage some points. 
the safety car gave me a good opportunity to turn things around. Pretty pleased overall, yeah. Speaking of the safety car, Devin Butler has gone on record calling you lucky to get the result you did. Did luck come into it today? A little bit of luck never hurt anyone, did it? Yeah, the safety car was really helpful for me. I discussed a couple of things with the team and I managed to take my chances afterwards. It played a big role in the result today. Teammate Aidan Jackson was forced to retire today. Would you say he's going through a bit of a rough patch? Mm, well, people have been giving him a bit of a hard time lately, but we all go through these patches from time to time. He's a promising young driver with a lot of talent. He'll come good. Great, well that's everything. Ryan. Cass, are you busy? Well, actually... Look, I need you to come to the office. Can you pop by now? Why? What's going on? Nothing. Nothing. I'll tell you all about it when you get here. Can't you just tell me now? Thanks so much, Casper. Really appreciate it. Casper. What's going on? We need to clear something up. Take a seat. Clear what up? Aiden thinks it's his fault that you're retiring. I'm sorry, Casper. I do respect you. Quite a lot, in fact. And I don't want you to retire. I didn't mean the things that I said. And I want you to know that if you're retiring because of me, I'll... <laughs> Will you tell him? This anxiety... It's no good for his performance. I'm not retiring because of you. But everyone says... I'm not retiring because of you. Can I go now? No. You're going to give him two minutes of your time. Well, Brian, what am I? His therapist. Two minutes, Casper. That's all. Everyone says... Everyone's an idiot. Look, I'm not retiring because of you. I told Brian after Zandvoort. I'm sorry you found out the way you did. It's tough. Yeah. Can be. The press. Social media. I don't know. How do you deal with it all? Listen. There's only a handful of us in the whole world who get to do what we do. Yeah. A handful. You deal with it by never forgetting how lucky you are to be here. Understand? Never forget. Hey, Casper. 
Yeah. Do you ever forget? Sometimes. Sometimes we all do. 